All right. Quarantine take four. Let's do it. Action. Welcome back to PE at Home with Mel. New and improved. Is it new? Yes, because this is a new video. Is it improved? Well, we'll find out together. Probably not. We'll see. Now, did you know that kids are supposed to do 60 minutes of exercise every single day? Well, now you do know, and I'm here to help you with that challenge. Now, there's actually lots of ways to achieve this 60 minute goal for every single day. You don't have to do the 60 minutes all at once. You could do a little bit here, a little bit there, a lot over here, but as long as it adds up to 60 minutes or more, then that's fantastic. There are different activities that you could do as well. So I know a lot of you have been going on daily walks. Well, that didn't sound good. I'll check on that later. I'm trying to film a video. All right, I think they've calmed down a bit next door, but if they scream, I'm just gonna assume that they're just really enthusiastic about getting their 60 minutes of exercise every single day. So if they scream again, I'm just gonna power through it. So let's try that again. There are lots of different activities that you can do to achieve your 60 minute goal of exercise every single day. So go for a walk with your family, that's perfect. If you've got a bike, wonderful scooter even better I love it all you can even do some yoga so there are so many different types of yoga like kids yoga online on YouTube maybe even your mum and dad know how to do yoga ask one of them find it online do some yoga it is incredibly hard I'm really bad at yoga but it's a really great way of getting your heart a pumping um, you could go to the park and you could throw a ball with a mate family member that'd be great practice your throwing all that good stuff that we do in our classes. Um, you could even, okay, I'm gonna level with you guys. And I know the parents are gonna love me for saying this, but doing household chores is actually a really great way to do exercise. So things like emptying the dishwasher genuinely can be really, really good as well. Although it's a short activity, so you have to do more things, but dishwasher, walk the dog. I'm sure Rover would love it. Um, what else could you do? Gardening. Oh my goodness, the, uh, gardening is such a great way of doing exercise and it's also so calming and wonderful and it gets you outside so I definitely recommend it. I just got an email, I don't know if you guys could hear that bing, but that's what that was. But household chores combined with going outside, going to the park, mmm, beautiful, beautiful, I love it all. If you need even more inspiration to help you to get to those 60 minutes, Lucky for you, last year I created about 20 videos for activities that you could do at home or outside. And I have sent them out to all of your parents already, but email me again if you need the link, I can send them to you and they're great. Not only do they give you ideas, but they also feature me hitting my computer with a gum nut, losing a balloon over the roof. Oh my goodness, this wind is unforgiving. Did you see that? And generally me just making a fool of myself and I know you guys love that. I know you guys love it. After that, I'm sorry, I'm gonna stop. Look at this. Look at this little boy. What are you doing, you silly thing? All right, this isn't one of the challenges. This is just my dog being really cute. So there is your challenge. For the next week or however long we're back in lockdown, I want you to do 60 60 minutes of exercise every single day. Get out of your houses, go get a nice tan, put on sunscreen, wear a hat, all that kind of stuff, but get outside, go do something, go have some fun. Because we know it's really boring inside if we spend all the time in there. So get out there, 60 minutes of exercise every single day. Stay safe, stay active, I will see you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>